misunderstood or misinterpreted either deliberately or intentionally the president's uh, statement that uh, he want to when he talked about uh, raising more taxes has been misinterpretation the idea is to raise the level of um, our taxes as a component of our GDP is still too low given the size of our economy in the region. It's still quite low. And it's for that reason that we talk about once you, you include more and more people, which is heavy in this uh, MTP4, we increase the revenue base. We expand the revenue base. And once that is, uh, that is uh, expanded, as we hope it will, we believe that um, more and more opportunities will be created. The areas that uh, P.S. Mwangi has spoken about, areas about uh, the blue economy, areas about the, the creative arts. You know, you, I'm sure you've heard about uh, the program called uh, Talanta Hela, this monetizing our creatives, our various talents, how to monetize them. It falls in our hands or in our shoulders to ensure that because there's a lot of talent all began by operationalizing the judiciary fund created under article 173 of the constitution we went on to add um, in fact to appoint the judges that had been pending we've just recently in fact, in 2022, end, end of 2022, we recruited a new set of judges, 20. Just last month, we added another 20. I can speak authoritatively that we are going to add another five to go to the anti-corruption court. And I did cause an amendment to the Judicature Act for the lawyers. Um, because you know the Judicature Act is the one that prescribes the number of judges in the Court of Appeal and the Court generally to increase the number from um, the current 30 to 70 but because we may not be able to appoint all of them at the same time and this is a medium term plan we have started by recruiting one of them and, uh, and retired so they were not 30, they were 29 so currently in fact beginning next week we will be recruiting, we will be interviewing an additional 11 judges of the Court of Appeal because it is important that also disputes disputes that go, that end up in court are resolved also expeditiously to avoid a situation whereby people, even investors, local and foreign, com keep complaining that the decisions take far too long in the, in the courts. But again, we've been encouraging and we are happy to work with the judiciary, uh, which has committed to alternative dispute resolution as provided for in Article 159 of the Constitution and exploring ways like mediation, other alternative mediation, reconciliation, other alternative justice systems available. Because we believe for the country also to 
to move to be to move forward properly we must have a stable judicial system ketenyo do akoma nya mivango ya thirikai igite mtp4 orera era align na mivango ya account cidp na nitwage koguo na nituma na na munya kamuno toro hona button general ni akuma ha na kieretha na ps na kieretha na ru industrial partition mo ni ko ni korehe investors ni ondo abadi addition no trate the kamuno ari mito na mawira direct na indirect ni ko hana mawira na ni tudite na mbere muno o mubango inyisho koguo muthi kuma thirikari nene uka kunyitanya na county nigo merethe andu mibango ya thirikari ireka tondu ni mokita guku thirikari nene ni okita guku ni gathikiriria andu ni gucoketi ringi kumerethe haira thirikari ikinyite ningi kwenda kumenya nayo county turane ni ya turanyitanira ati na mibango ya thirikari nene na itwa ki explain mwana wa thiru itwa finance na itwa ki ta gukiona nyira twa ta kunyitanira maundu ni mengi na thirikari nene maundu ma health ma varavara na maundu ta macio no rohogerwa agriculture Oro wa agriculture ni turamenya thirikari ni rehete maundu maingi muno nigetha increase productivity. Oro wa kuheana subsidized fertilizers ile era haya no kundu guothe na currently over 50,000 eh, million bags ni so siya nito. Ogrora value chain ile ike si guku oro wa mushere oro wa kahua oro wa mashani ni sio turarura nigetha twari horo wa agriculture tukeyuria guku iratuteithia atia na tugakirwo tungihota kuongerera productivity ona kindu kiria tugwikira mihuko no gikuingiha ugacoka ukarora uhoro ngi ta wa health uhoro wa universal health coverage na currently ni turerwo ni turarehe uhoro wa the health insurance cover ile go cover almost 85% of everybody ero maudu macio ni mo turarora across the country plan ivya ga myaka etano ya biriria hindi ya vision 2030 28 yegithie ya mbere kuma 28 erathie ya keri ya gatatu ni wera thirire june 2023 ndu ino igukorwa ni mufango wa myaka etano wa thirikari uri ugukorwa uki implement wo ni honge sio the sia thirikari the ministries na nisho siga nitio into sector siga corona sector idatha tu o every ministry ni rathondeka strategic plan ile era draw kuma this plan na tugasaina uhoro wa performance contract nigetha maundu maria me mtp4 kana mufango uyu wa miaka wa kana wa ku implement vision 2030 ukinyanire hari andu othe ogwo ni mufango wa guthi miaka 5 na uharirirwe ati tukirikia tondu tugukorwa tukiririe kurikia the vision 2030 ya mwaka wa 2030 ni tugukorwa turorete uhoro wa gdp ikorwe kinyite around 7.2% kuma hari eri umuthi 4.8 ma the more the more managana ndu ogwo uri andu maiguithanirie guku kirinya kana kure kuge guothe kuko kwena kuru kwena wathorera kuthondeka mweru kana uwezo kwiho kwena gucijio tuguthi na bego cijia kuringana na maoni na mapendekezo na mwananchi kuma hogeciothe eh niguo